Hey everyone. Welcome back to my another Linux tutorial. Today we are going to install Android in Linux machine. So let's get started. Open up the app launcher. And search for terminal. Open the terminal by clicking the terminal icon. All the commands are given in the description. Please download the test file and follow me. Run the first command to add the necessary pp to your repository. Just copy the command and paste it in your terminal. Note that Ctrl plus Shift plus V is the shortcut for paste operation in terminal window, not Ctrl plus V. Wait until the process is completed. This may be depend on your internet speeds. Explanation about each commands are given in the description file. And basic details about basic commands are in the first tutorials. If you are new here please hit the subscribe button. After the execution is completed. Run the next command to update the information about packages available in repository. Install and box modules by running the next command. This takes some time. So let's talk about Anbox. Anbox puts the Android operating system into a container, abstracts hardware access and integrates core system services into a GNU Linux system. Every Android application will be integrated with your operating system like any other native application. The whole source code is available as open source and licensed under the terms of the Apache and GPL version 3 license. For more information check out the website Anbox.io. Anbox is not including Play Store. So installing and uninstalling apps is quite different. Copy and paste all the commands as shown in this video. Now we are installed all the required kernel modules. After that we need to manually load the kernel modules. Run these commands for that. Install and box snap by running the command. Enter the password and hit enter. I will write back after the installation is completed. Now the installation is completed. 
run the remaining commands. And box is now ready to use. Let's open it. Open Ubuntu dock and search for Anbox. Here you are. Some necessary apps like calendar files music settings are already installed. Click on clock to open the clock app. Looks like everything working fine. Let's maximize and check some functions. Good. Alarm stopwatch, counter. All are working fine. Let's close it. Now open settings app. It look like Android 7.1.1 Nougat. To install any app, you need to install Fastboot and ADB. Type these commands for install it. Now download an APK file from internet. I am using the website called APK Mirror for downloading the app. Download the app from internet and let me show you how to install it.
Let's open Nbox again to see the changes. As you can see, there is no third party applications are installed. Open terminal and run the command sudo su. Enter the password and hit enter. To install app change the directory to desktop. Running ls will show the files in desktop. You can see an apk is also there. That's the downloaded one. To install run adb install app name dot apk. That's it. The app is successfully installed. Now let's check whether it is working or not. Looks like everything working perfectly is like a native application. Alright and thank you for watching this video. Like share subscribe for more videos.